What's going on, Internet Pips? Um, today we're going to unlock the Metro PCS Samsung Exhibit, I think, and um, it's um, the Model T599N. Um, it's um, the Samsung Galaxy um, Exhibit from Metro PCS. Alright, um, to unlock this one today, we're going to use the Zaxbox. box. Um, I'm doing this video because um, I had some trouble um, unlocking this phone. And um, I see the, a couple people on the internet. Um, I had no success on doing it. So, so the first thing we're going to do, we need to root this baby right here. So I'm um, just going to unpack it and uh, we'll be back. Uh, with the follow up on how to wrote it. Right, um, I'm back with the video. What uh, after the initial setup, you need to um, to go to settings, scroll down to develop options, make sure it's enabled, and then um, just select um, USB debugging. After that. Just uh, go back to the main screen, and uh, you are going to um, actually connect the USB on your computer. Let me just do this. All right. Sorry, you just have two hands. I can uh, I need to do uh, the video and the um, the connections. So after that, we are going to your computer, and uh, we are going to use um, the CDN impactor to um, to root the phone. Uh, you can find the CD impactor over the internet, but um, I will list the link under this video. So I uh, just double click on impactor. And uh, after that, just click on, on start. And uh, as you can see, it's doing its thing. All right, at this point, your phone should be rooted. But since Impactor doesn't, um, doesn't install super user automatically, after the process with Impactor, you are going uh, to your phone again. Open that uh, Google Play. Click on search and you are going to search for super... Oh shit. Super user. All right, so uh, there's two, um, actually two super users you can install. We are going to install the the clockwork mode one, the one I like best. So just install it. Should be installed right now. All right, so um, the first thing you open um, Super User is gonna ask you to install uh, the binary. So just go to Winstall, and you should get the screen installation. Of Super User was successful. Let's click on OK, and um, you should be good now. All right, at this point, what we need to do is um, open up um, Samsung 2 on the computer. It takes a while to open up. All right, I'm using um, Samsung 2 16.1. I think it's the latest version, and uh, here 
as you can see I have the the T599N selected um, you've got two ports you make sure you select the Zax box serial box uh, even though um, the the phone is connected via USB as you can see the phone is connected via USB on the computer it's fine it needs to be like this you know I've tried um, doing um, directly on the UART um, cable but didn't work if you want this to work make sure you connect the USB cable on the computer go to um, Samsung to select Zaxbox serial port and then just click on unlock as you can see um, as you can see right here it um, detected the phone and everything you know we checked if the phone um, has super user bright and um, uh, at the bottom you will see um, Samsung 2 is asking to connect the phone via UART cable after that just disconnect the phone from the computer go to your Zax uh, box connect the UART cable and go to your phone and connect the cable as well and then after that Samsung 2 will detect the phone via UART and um, it will say um, unlock done and the codes have been set to eight zeros after that turn um, disconnect the phone first turn off the phone and um, you will need to insert a no accepted SIM card on the phone AT&T, T-Mobile, doesn't matter, and a GSM um, SIM card on the phone. I'll be back. I'm back with the video. As you can see, I have a... Uh, I don't know if you can see very well. Uh, the phone camera is kind of fucked up, has the flash on. But um, as you can see, I have an AT&T SIM card on the phone. Turn on the phone. Wait for the boot. Uh, all right so when your phone boots back on it's gonna ask for the SIM network unlock pin as you can see on Zax um, it res uh, reset the the codes to eight zeros so just go to your phone and type eight zeros Hit, hit the lock. You can see network code saxophone. Sorry, that's it. You know, uh, if you like the video, go to facebook.com backslash geek express Boston. And that's it, people. Thanks a lot.